honor for me to introduce Carrie Mae Weems, because I'm a longtime admirer of her work, much of which is steeped in African American history. She insists on the importance of the work of black women, both in art and life. Considered one of the most influential contemporary artists, Carrie Mae Weems has investigated family relationships, cultural identity, sexism, class, political systems, and the consequences of power. She sustained an ongoing dialogue around these issues for many years. During this time, she's developed a complex body of work, employing photographs, text, fabric, audio, digital images, installation, and video. Although she does employ a variety of means and addresses an array of issues, she has an overarching commitment to better understanding the presence and a close examination of history and identity is also found throughout her work. A notion of universality is also present. While African-Americans are typically her primary subjects, Weems wants people of color to stand with the human multitudes and for her art to resonate with audiences of all races. New York Times critic Holland Cotter wrote, Ms. Weems is what she has always been, a superb image maker, focused, irrepressible. When she tackles complex subjects in complex ways, the results are deeply stirring. Uh, David Bonnet wrote in Post Dispatch that Weems is one of the most honored American artists of her generation. Weems asks inconvenient questions and comes up with unwelcome answers. For that reason alone, no contemporary artist's work is more important. Carrie Mae Weems makes us see. And once we truly see, we are transformed and feel obliged, even compelled to act. Congratulations, Ms. Weems, on this well-deserved recognition for your brilliant and beautiful work for being one of the very best in what you do and for caring enough to show us who we really are. It's an extraordinary honor to be considered along with some of the great photographers, great artists of our time, to have my name, to have my father's name mention uh, along with some of the great photographers of our times is, 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 is truly a, an honor and I'm, I'm, I'm deeply grateful. You know, these were sort of extraordinary artists who also didn't really, I think, really talk about their contribution, but their contributions were enormous. And that part of the way in which we understand the contribution is to the extent that it influences the field that it broadens and expands the dimension of the way in which we think about the field of photography. I've been deeply influenced, and I do have a sense, however, that, for instance, my Kitchen Table series has been deeply influential amongst uh, any number of younger uh, photographers and image makers and visual artists, and it's kind of wonderful to sort of see uh, this uh, new work kind of emerging that addresses this work that uh, that I made humbly 35 years ago, uh, just trying to figure out my way in the field of photography. But what does it mean to be an image maker? What does it mean to be a photographer? And what kind of photographer was I precisely, right? Was I a documentary photographer? Was I a reportage photographer? I wasn't a fashion photographer, that's for sure. You know, a friend of mine used to say, or, or there is the saying that you know, a photograph is worth a thousand words. And my great friend, Fred Lonerdeer said, that's absolutely true. But which thousand are you speaking of specifically? <laughs> so photography and contribution and how to make and how to think about image building and image making uh, has been important. And that I knew early on that I absolutely uh, wanted to contribute to the field. A project like Take Six COVID, the COVID project that I've been working on since the pandemic, which has been um, very important to me and has really been uh, my, my anchor uh, during this extraordinary time, the sort of 
confluence of things from the Black Lives Matter movement to this uh, extraordinary pandemic, to these shifts that are taking place within the environment, right? You know, all of these amazing historic moments that um, image makers are still grappling with. And we are grateful to photographers and videographers for the images and material that they bring to us about our world. So, of course, receiving this award has been absolutely uh, wonderful. It's, and it's beautiful. I can't wait to wear it. It's a little heavy, but it is really quite beautiful. My name is inscribed on the back. And I'm only sorry that my father isn't here uh, to see um, his child receive this, uh, this award. And I want to thank Dr. Said so much for uh, the introduction and for recognizing the importance and the value of the work and for somehow uh, his willingness to, to introduce me on this auspicious occasion. And I'm only sorry that I can't be there in person to, to meet you and to thank you and to, to shake your hand. But I know that we'll be able to do that sometime in the future because St. Louis is one of my favorite cities.